Hey everybody and welcome back to Planning and More with Me's. If this is your first time here, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. I'm so excited to share my passions and my hobby with you. And if you're coming back and are one of my regular subscribers, thank you so much for coming back and joining me today. So, okay y'all. Remember when I said that I was only going to stick with my mini because it was super cute and I really loved it and I had a purse for it and it's great? Well, I miss the classic so dang much. Now, here's the thing. With my mini, I thought, okay, I am not working right now, so I have, you know, I don't have a lot of things that I'm writing down and it seems like I'm just using more stickers and anything else to fill in the space. And, guys, first off, if you live in Canada, you know that it is almost impossible to find mini sticker books, okay? Like, sticker books just for the mini planner. It is almost impossible. I have one sticker book out of, like, the 45 sticker books that I have that is for the mini. And so, most of the time, I'm doing a lot of sticker surgery, which is great, because it allows me to like dig into my creativity but then it's super frustrating because sometimes I just want to put the sticker down and move on. So work is coming up around the corner. Um, the government gave us the go ahead that they are opening schools so work is around the corner and I thought I would get back into my classic size. So remember when I purged and bought all the stuff for the classic size? Well, guess what? Now I can actually use it. See? So it didn't really go to waste. Now did it, hubby? All right. <laughs> so I am going to Franken plan, of course. And this video is going to be my setup video for August of 2020. All right. So um, I will be using the teacher planner for my social media. Um, so it has, you know, the different boxes and stuff. And then I'll be using, um, this modern farmhouse one. And this one's gonna, this one's a dashboard, um, layout. So I will be using this from, like, my regular catch-all because I actually do quite enjoy, um, the dashboard layout. Normally I use a vertical for work, but I don't think I'm gonna have to use a vertical. I think I should be okay with the dashboard and I really like it. So I'm going to stick to the dashboard because I love that I can put my gratitude here um, and then I can like fix this to make it more suitable for what I need it for. Um, I'm just excited that there is more space. So this will be for my catch-all and then I'm going to continue using the horizontal layout for my intentional reading um, where I can kind of just write down, like, quotes, um, maybe a certain way, like, or, or just how I feel about what I've read, um, because it, sometimes some of the books that I'm reading in the book club that I'm in, um, really pulls at my heartstrings, you know, so sometimes it's nice to just be able to write stuff down, um, and then I will use this guy, of course, for the front of my planner, I will add in the budget extension and I will add in the fitness extension and then I'm going to be using these cute gold expander metal discs. Now, I haven't yet decided about whether or not I'm going to use this as my cover or if I'm going to go back to this guy as my cover. Um, I have to see kind of what fits better in my purse. So for now, I think I'll just stick with the modern far uh, farmhouse one um, because I like that it doesn't have a date on it. And then we'll go from there. All right. So I'm sorry that that was a little, well, that was a lot. So let's just jump right into the video. Okay. So that is loud. Okay, so let's start with this guy because I will be taking um, the cover off of it. So, one, two. Okay, um, 
oh, so that uh, front part, the hello this planner belongs to, actually came right out of this guy. So that works out perfectly. Um, so also, I'm sorry that my nails look super ratchet. I tried the dip powder, dip well powder acrylic nails, and they just didn't suit my nails very well. So all the hard work that I put into um, getting them stronger literally went down the drain. But that's okay. I mean, I love the aspect of the dip powder. Like, I, I think it's super convenient. Um, I can see that if it had worked for me, I would have continued using them. Um, but I think I'll just wait till I am back at work. I like this cover too, this side of it. But I think I'll just wait till I'm back at work to um, do my nails again. Because I am going to be doing my nails again. I just... I'm not in a rush to get, to, to get into a nail salon right now, considering how busy they are. So, we'll just wait. Alright. Okay, I think this looks super cute with the um, gold metal discs and I'm actually really excited to get right back into the classic size. All right, so let's, I just wanna make sure that I'm in frame. I'm sorry that the camera keeps shaking. So I actually brought my desk. I have a room upstairs. I have three bedrooms in my house and I have um, a room, one of the bedrooms upstairs I I had kept for, you know, my, um, Oh my gosh my craft room and it's great because I have like all my scrapbooking stuff all my yarn because I do like to crochet sometimes um, and then of course all my books and planners and stuff now it's great that I have you know a room upstairs but it's super irritating when you know I'm stuck in a room all day and I don't want to be stuck in a room all day you know what I mean like it's annoying when I have to, when I'm downstairs and then my husband's like, oh, can you bring the laptop down? Or, oh crap, we gotta go print this. And then I have to go all the way upstairs and like, super frustrating. So in my house, we have a um, formal dining room that we were going to use as a dining room. But realistically, like to find a, uh, to find a table, that worked just it, like we couldn't realistically we couldn't find anything that worked so I ended up um, putting a bookshelf in here and putting you know some more couches but then that meant that I had two living rooms which was also really annoying so I asked my husband and my brother I'm just gonna shift this camera just a little I don't like the way it's falling um, I asked my husband and my brother to bring well to take the couches up and bring the desk down and it's just nice that, that, that my desk is on the first floor uh, like on the main floor so I feel you know I don't feel like I'm cooped up inside the uh, room all day so okay so oops I'll put in um my okay so I'm putting in three months so I've put in um, August, September, and October. I like the neutral colors of it. All right, so after my catch-all, I will do my social media. So I'm going to get into this puppy, and I'm going to take out August, September, and October. So we have August. Um, I definitely do like how easy it is to um, Franken plan with these planners. I do appreciate it. It's funny because I've been using the Happy Planner system since 2016, kind of on and off. And um, the biggest issue actually that I had with the Happy Planner was that everything was like all the calendars and everything were drawn in for me. I used to bullet journal so I used to do everything on my own and 
like as much as I loved it, it was super time consuming. So I'd kind of hop back and forth between this guy and um, my bullet journal. So, and then eventually, yes, the Happy Planner won. <laughs> so, okay, there goes my social media stuff. After social media, I will hop into this guy for um, my book log. Now, in my mini, like, I wasn't always using it, which is not good, but um, I really do like being able to have a space where I can write everything down. Um, it just gives me more, you know, um, more intentional reading time, which I really enjoy. Okay, so what I'm going to do for my other videos is I will have a separate video out for um, how I'm setting up each uh, month, like not each month, but each part. So I'll do them in separate videos so that it's not, this one's not a long dragging or dragged out process. And I can't even talk guys, look at that. <laughs> okay. Come on. All right, so um, I have my catch-all, I have my social media, I have my book log. I will then get into the fitness. So I'll add the fitness section into here. Um, I like this because, as you guys know, I've said this before, but as you guys know, I'm in the process of doing IVF because my husband and I have been struggling with infertility. Um, so this just really helps with making sure that I'm eating the right foods and all that stuff. Okay, so I have my fitness, I have my budget. I've been slacking in this as well, but I promise not to. <laughs> like famous last words my husband always says. And then, okay, so that's good. I'm gonna just get these out of the way so that I could add some more things into it. Okay, so now um, I wanna add a note section. So I do have um, this guy. Oh, I can also use this as my cover as well, actually. I think I might just use this one because I like this one more. Um, so that was kind of dumb guys and I cut up the paper that was in here to put in my mini so I actually don't like this is all I have left which in hindsight is kind of silly but it's okay because I still have enough of it so it'll work it's fine um, so I'll put these in the back Oh, I'll have to do them little by little. Um, so I like to keep paper in here for notes. I do like to do my trackers on here. So um, I will be creating a Shark Week tracker um, for my classic. I already have a book log for my classic, so I will use that. I made one for my mini too, which is really cute. But the one for my, I just have to find it. I don't know where I put it. It's somewhere with all these papers, but I know it's here. Um, okay, so that's that. But you know what? I'm actually... I'm just going to use this guy because I actually like this guy better. Oh, this thing can be noisy. I actually really like the cheetah print. So I forgot I had this guy. I'm going to use this guy as my cover instead of this one. Alright, just pop these guys out. These discs are pretty cute though, so it's, I mean, it's great for pictures. <laughs> and I just love that this cover says you are so great on top of the fact that it's like a leopard print. So 
I am digging the way this looks. Okay. Um, I could probably use, I have like an entire Ziploc bag stuff full of discs. It is unbelievable, but you know, it is what it is. <laughs> All right, cool. I think that is, oh, I have one more disc here. I'll put that away later. I think that's it. So I, I can use these cause I can, I can use them for notes and stuff, and I love that it's the cheetah print one. But I also have um, these guys that I got when I ordered the um, Be Happy Wild Style box. So I've got those. And then I also have daily sheets that I could add when I start work. So I'll put those in there once I'm actually at work. Um, I'll save these for later. But then I also have, um, let me see here. I have a whole bunch of stuff here in my desk. Um, so I'm gonna use these guys. They're just, it's just like blank paper and it says follow your heart. So what I've decided to do is for every book that I'm reading, I'm kind of gonna dedicate one page to this and I'm gonna write down like all the things about the book that I really enjoyed, so look out for that one and then I will also add in um I'll also add in I probably might put in some lined paper actually um for notes because like, I think I should just have some note paper in here let me see oh I shook the camera I'm so sorry so I might I haven't decided which one just yet but um i got this one in the grab bag from michael's which is super excited oh i don't necessarily like the back though i like the front okay so i won't use these ones i'm gonna give this one to my mom i think all right so i'm gonna i just got have, have this planner babe notes the happy notes and i'm just gonna pull out um the lined ones and add that in the back as well just so that I have um, some I guess choices of whether or not I want to dock it or not and I think that's it so let's open this guy back up I think I'll put it in front of the dots. And it's just nice to have some note paper in here. You know, in case I need to like take some notes or write some write things down, because I'm always taking notes. Alright. So and also, actually, I don't know where I put it though. Uh, I brought everything down that I wanted to use, but now I just can't seem to find anything, which is super frustrating. Ah! Okay, that's okay. When I find it. Famous last words, right guys? When I find it. Okay, so... I have a whole bunch of, um... Dashboards that I can use. But I think I might stick with... What I have going on in my mini right now. I like the mini ones so I might pull them out of here I think oh yeah actually I will because I decorated them right like so I have to I have to use them um that's what I'm gonna do that would be a waste not to use them so the one thing I really actually appreciate about um, the happy planner system is that I can literally like use the, the you know I can use um, oh my gosh the dashboards from all different sizes so that is actually super exciting that makes me happy I will switch the top off part though because it's a little frustrating but that's okay so oh no 
Ugh, wrong place. Okay. Um, so I'll put this one here. I don't really care that it's not as big. I just love how decorated it is. Okay, and then, so this is my regular. This will be my social media. Okay, and October, and then we have August. So this will be um, my book log. And then this is a fitness. Okay. And then I took out um, this one, should actually say budget, so I will just redo that one. Okay. And then I'll have one for notes my note page like these will be my note pages okay and then I'll have one more back here so most of my trackers are always done on the grid paper like the dot grid paper, sorry, not grid, dot grid. And I think I'll use this guy because it's super cute. So just take that bad boy off. And then this one will be for trackers. Perfect. All right, I am digging the way this looks. I absolutely love it. Awesome. Okay, so let's do a super quick flip through of everything that is in here now. Okay, so this is the cover. Hi there. This happy planner belongs to, I'm not sure if I'm going to put Shamiza or um, planning and more with me's. I think I'll just put Shamiza because, you know, it's my name. All right, so I have my calendar here so that has august september october and then i have my social media august september and october that's gonna fall okay and then i have my book log august september october and then i have my fitness for august and then my budget for august and then I have my note section and then my trackers. So stay tuned for um, pictures on my Instagram for my Shark Week tracker. Um, I already have a book one, so I don't need to track that. And then I'll be making like a memories page for my 30th birthday because I do want that to be something that I remember. And I'm also thinking of doing a positive affirmations page. Um, if you have seen my last video, um, I mentioned um, in the when I did the Michaels haul video, um, I mentioned that I haven't really been feeling myself lately and I've been feeling super down and just really sad. So I wanted to kind of make a positive affirmations uh, page where I can look at look at and just kind of you know, take that positivity from, right? So look out on my Instagram for that one as well. Awesome. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching the setup video. Um, I really do appreciate all the love and the support that you give. Um, like I've mentioned before, I couldn't do this without each and every one of you. I feel like I talked a lot in this video, but um, I hope for those of you who are watching, you don't think it's too much. Um, but like I said, you know, I, I really appreciate you. I couldn't do this without each and every one of you. So thank you, thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart. All right, y'all, that's it for today. Um, I will catch you in the next video. Thank you guys again. Remember, be kind to one another, and we'll see you later. Bye.